how's it going? Today I am doing a review of a candle company called Price Candle. Um, and then at the end of the video, I'm gonna have show you guys um, me taking out my ring from this candle and finding out the value of it and stuff like that. So it's gonna be pretty exciting. Um, let's get started. So Price Candle, the candles look like this, is a very interesting and cool um, candle company. What it is, is you buy the candle for um, $25 and then um, inside there is a ring that is worth anywhere from $10 to $5,000. Uh, they are very, very high quality candles and they're nine ounces and they are come in a very classic, classy looking uh, jar. There's an example. That's um, the fig flavored or smelling one. Mm, so good and they're really fun to give as gifts or just buy for yourself because you're paying $25 for the candle then automatically you get a gift of at least $10 of the um, ring inside okay so first I'm going to review the scents of the candles that I have with me right now and um, the cool thing about them is that they are constantly coming out with seasonal and limited edition and um, like kind of always changing up their scents so it doesn't get boring. Um, some of the scents I have may not be on the website right now but they may come back you know when the season comes around or um, some of the scents I have I might not have like many of the scents that are currently on the website because there's a lot of fall and winter um, smells but mm, let me get one. All right, let's start with the happy birthday one. This is part of their celebrations, like, collection or whatever. And it smells like birthday cake, like straight up birthday cake. It's really sweet, and it gives off a um, very vibrant smell in the room. And um, I really, really like it. It's perfect gift because it literally says happy birthday on it. Um, in this collection, they also have, um, like, an it's a boy one. Or it's called a, a star is born, and it's got a blue... Um, sticker for the boy and then a star is born with a pink sticker there's also a silver let me see um happy anniversary one and um i think there might be a wedding one too but um those ones are really good for special occasions obviously okay uh just a little disclaimer they are all really messy around them because um you have to take the the ring out of the wax and then i got wax all over the sides of them so that's why they look really messy but um i will talk more about the getting the ring process uh after i talk about the scents so this next one I have is the Sweet Citrus. I know this is a permanent one. They've had this one since I started buying candles and it was my first candle. It's um, just like it says, it's very, it's citrusy, less orangey, more limey, I would say. And the label looks like that. It's their classic label with the um, color around the diamond shape. And um, it's, it's really nice. It's also the one that I have burning behind me right now. Uh, I got... It for my birthday again I think and then this was like the first one I ever had but I really like it okay the next one is called white tea and I believe that this is also one that they always have because it was I think the second one that we bought and it's it's got a very um, nice tea flavor along with a flowery kind of flavor or scent I always say flavor mm, it's it's very clean I would put this like um, on like a a April day I would say like something like in the early spring because it's just so like fresh and clean and like I guess like getting away from like the spicy scents of like the winter and going into like the first candle of the um spring that's what I would do that's I think what we actually did <laughs> so good <laughs> so then the next one they also currently have I don't know how um how permanent it is because it's fairly new but it's called Caribbean Breeze and it's the most tropical one we have um, it has the blue label. Um, it's just, they don't say like any, any <laughs> scents, and I'm really bad at describing scents, but it's just really tropical um, and really refreshing. I like it. I would kind of probably put this in a bathroom because I see bathrooms as more of like the, the beachy themed stuff. At least that's what the bathroom in my house is beach themed. 
and it's just very like beachy and tropical it's nice i like this one too it's probably it's definitely not my favorite but it's still um good good candle okay the last one that i have with me is called adriatic fig mm, this one's nice I never really knew what a fig smells like um, because I don't eat figs very often, ever, I think. Um, but it's just really warm and clean. Again, none of the candles are very um, spicy, none of the ones that I have. Um, I know they now they um, are coming out with the fall stuff and have a lot of spicy ones, and I think there's like a new leather one. Um, but this is uh, another really clean one. and. Um, they're just, they're just all really nice. This candle, I don't have one with me, but it's actually my favorite candle, which is surprising why I can't find it to, to save my life. Um, we have like a million candles. I'm like, i in love with candles, but so I can't find this one because I haven't burnt it since like February. Um, it is the one is called XO and I think it had like a red like outline around the, um, diamond. And we won it on, or my mom actually won it on their Facebook, um, they were doing a giveaway, and it was the uh, Valentine's Day one, so it smelled like chocolate. And normally I hate things that are like artificial chocolate, like smells and all that stuff, but I loved it. It, it smelled just like chocolate. It was not like the artificial chocolate smell, it was just like, oh, okay, I need some chocolate now. Yeah, it was really good, and so I really, really, really hope that comes out again next um, Valentine's Day, because I'll be picking up at least one or two. Yeah. So that is all the scents that I have tried. Um, now on to the process of getting the candle out, or the getting the ring out of the candle. Um, so if you see, like, this is the front, like I had shown you before, of the um, candles, and if you turn it around, that there's a sticker on the back that represents where the um, the uh, ring is. So you burn the candle down and slowly you can start to see like the little plastic holder that holds the ring. And then you can take tweezers or once it's still hot, you can take tweezers or um, pliers or your fingers if you really want to, probably is pretty hot, and you just pull it out and then um, you have yourself a ring. Um, they, my one downside to this is that they get really messy so they're not very pretty afterwards um, because you know it's, it's all full of wax. Um, and then another downside is that you can't choose like, oh, I'm ring size seven, so I want um, my candle to have a size seven ring in it. It's just kind of like, uh, you get a random ring. So um, if you have like abnormally like small or like very large fingers, um, it's probably not the perfect candle for you. But since I have like the most common ring size, the size seven ring, um, it, it works for me because I can wear almost every single ring that I've gotten. So now I'm gonna show you my collection of the rings that I've gotten um, from my price candles uh, from ordered from least favorite to most favorite. This is my least favorite ring. It was my very first ring um, out of my first prize candle. And it's a purple small little gemstone with dark metal. Um, it is, like, I would say the right size for me, but I just think it's a little bit too dark for my liking. And it was a $10 ring. This second ring is probably the opposite of the other one in all ways. It is very big and flashy, and it's got a big light pink jewel in this center, um, and then it's got little jewels on the side. This one um, I've worn a few times, and it's a little bit too big for me, so um, it's not completely comfortable, and the pink doesn't match um, the giant pink diamond, or jewel doesn't match um, very many things that I own. Okay, this next ring I, I pretty I like a lot. Um, it's pretty simple and I like to layer this ring with other rings. Um, it's a purple sideways little stone with um, like a twisty band, I guess. And I think this one was one of the higher priced ones at like 25 and I, I, it's really cute. The next ring is another $25 one. It was, um, it's a pink gemstone 
and it's a little bit too big for me so I don't wear it very much but I might I'll probably give it to one of my cousins or someone um, because I think it's really pretty but it's just not wearable for me because it's not comfortable Okay, this next ring is another $10 one. Um, I got this, it's, pro it's my second favorite ring that I've gotten so far. Um, I love it because it's definitely my style. I like the tone of this jewel a lot more. And it is, um, it reminds me a lot of Princess and the Frog or like Tiana and she's my favorite princess. So I think this one's really cute. And I've worn this one uh, quite a bit, especially when I first got it. This last ring is my absolute favorite. I wear it very, very often, almost, I would say like multiple times a week. It is a um, blue gemstone with a halo of little um, like clear cubic zirconium or something like that around it. Um, it is my $50 ring and my absolute favorite. It is so gorgeous. It goes with everything and it fits perfectly. This is like my my number one ring okay so now I'm gonna show you how me and my boyfriend he helps me um, take out the ring and then I will show you what the ring is worth which is like the most fun part um, so yeah here here's that clip okay guys this is my boyfriend showing us how he removes my prize candles out of the as you can see, we burnt it down low enough that you can see the little baggie that holds the candle. So he is going to go ahead and remove it with scissors. everyone thank you so much for watching this video I hope that you enjoyed and that this helped you if you like to buy candles and you like to wear rings um, this company I would say I would give it four and a half stars out of five um, I think compared to other companies that um, do the same sort of thing these candles are higher quality and they are definitely like more classy looking and classic looking I would recommend that anybody buy one of these candles because they are just amazing smelling. They put off a lot of scent. They are gorgeous looking and then you get the little extra added bonus of a ring inside. Um, if you guys want to buy one, you can. Um, I have a link down in um, the bottom bar which has like a link to my like friend code. So you will get uh, $10 off of your first candle and I will get $10 off of my next candle. So uh, if you guys want to buy one, you go ahead and do that there. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it was very helpful. If you um, have any requests, please leave them in the comments below and thumbs up this video. Thank you very much for watching. I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!